Uh, uh, what's your favorite part of Sound of Music in Minus? Oh, God. Um, the response from the audience, the response from the company, the fact that uh, people are surprised there's so much talent where we live, and uh, all the good it's still. Why does this story touch people's lives so much? It's the sound of music. The sound of music. I mean, it's, yeah, it's the roots. Everybody knows the sound of music, right? Do you think it has special significance here because there's hills here and we people relate to hills and the hills are alive? No. <laughs> <laughs> it's a nice thought, though. <laughs> How many, uh, how much time before you go on stage? Um, right at the beginning. So how much time do you have right now to uh, be nervous? What time is it? 25 minutes. So how do you think it's going to go tonight? How do you think the crowd is? They sound eager. Um, they were great last night. They were great last night, yeah. Um, so what's uh, what's your role? What's my role? I am the mean and nasty nun. After last night, there can be no doubt we read her mother's mind about Maria. I gave her permission to leave. Right. Are you ever nervous? Yeah. Are you nervous tonight? A little bit. She's always late for everything except for every meal. I hate to have to say it, but I bet. I'm Sister Margareta, and um, I'm enjoying the park very much. What is your favorite part of the park? The favorite part? Laughing, because I love to laugh. I'd like to say a word in her behalf. Then say it, Sister Margareta. Maria makes me laugh. from me already and I can't even have a reaction from you because which part, which part, after I say makes me laugh you've already turned away and made no I did not yes you did I did not I, I, did I always say I've seen your back the last the wackiest nuns ever you know what though she, she must be looking she must be looking at you and then turning away because the audience always laughs at her first and then me yeah because I do I don't so see what do your say? face But you're also down there studying Maria. Does that mean you know all the lines and the last minute, if anything happens, you can replace Maria? Yep. I'd love to see that at some point. I would love to do it. <laughs> it's probably my last chance. I'm going to be too old and decrepit to do it in another year or two.
personally, I think I'm really sharp tonight. <laughs> oh, that's true. Oh, that's you are. Yeah, that's true. No, you're pulling it's, together the story It's a very good audience. It's line. not as wild as last night. Well. <laughs> it's a very good audience. It's a little more conservative than last night, but they're with us, and that's wonderful. What is the best thing about your role as Maria? I feel like I'm an inspiration. I feel like I've been able to draw in the kids and make them feel part of this. And I feel like I can touch people. And it's the role that does it. It's not so much me, it's the role. How close is the Maria character uh, to your actual personality? Probably too close. It's a bit scary at times. <laughs> What's the best number? Oh, that's a tough one for me. Um, <sighs> I love the love scene. I don't know why, because of the connection with the audience. Nothing about the kissing or anything like that. <laughs> <laughs> Have you actually rehearsed with the captain? Or? Like, and then you can go... Not how, do, how do you think, if you were to step in suddenly, how do you think you you would do the kiss no, like, in an ordinary a couple? Just That's not a problem for you? Not if you're, if you're thrown into that situation. I have had to rehearse a kiss before, and that's pretty amusing. It's amusing how two middle-aged people could still act like stupid teenagers. <laughs> right. They're not used to kissing each other. Right. Bob, what's your role? What's your role in uh, Sound of Music? What's my role in this uh, series? Uh, well, what's your What's your uh, the character? What's your character? Harry Zeller, uh, who's a mean little Nazi. Before the fight, flight. Captain Von Trapp was never. I mean, I only take my orders from Captain Von Trapp. You will take your orders from us from now on, and so will the captain. Hi. Uh -huh. People to pick me to play that one and the Admiral. Do you think there's any similarity at all between you and the Nazis? I hope not. <laughs> I'm here to present you with your permission. I am deeply conscious of the orders. Your orders are to report to the naval base in Bremer Harbor immediately. But here, that would be impossible. Admiral, may I present my wife, the Baroness von Trapp? Ah, I have no trust. Well, 
for me to say is, we're all singing in the Carlsberg Festival. That doesn't say, what are you going to sing, Kevin? What are you, you going to sing? You may come to the concert and hear us. I'd like to hear you sing now. Why would you sing? What are you going to sing in the festival? Sure, yes. Sing! Go with dear female. So what's the most fun? Uh, being together with all the people here backstage, watching people perform, and then afterwards mingling with the uh, with locals, see what they uh, they thought. Of but I, I, I'm gonna miss probably everybody here just hanging around. With them. What's your favorite? What's your favorite part of the play? I I like it all. <laughs> what's your favorite song? I, I would say Edelweiss. Sheila, so what do you think about your role and how close is your role to your actual personality? I think it's quite close. <laughs> okay. A little bit, I know. <laughs> name of your character and how is that different from your own character? Uh, the character is Franz Schmidt. Uh, he's a butler, he's middle-aged, and he's a Nazi. <laughs> I'm not a Nazi. And I'm not a butler. <laughs> because it is kind of close to my personality during the day. When I'm off at night, I do let my hair down. I didn't think we had enough practices, but I'm 
Okay, what's the hardest part that you have to do in the role of Liesl? Probably wear pantyhose. Yes, pantyhose. I hate pantyhose, and I keep getting runs in them, like right all the way down. So yeah, this is my third year. Uh, my heart, the hardest part? Yeah. Um, remembering when to be on. That it have to be it. Yeah. Chasing Rob wasn't hard. Was uh, I thought it was, but it turned out to be okay. What's the hardest thing about the role? I don't really think there is a hardest part. <laughs> What's the easiest and most fun part? The song and dance. How close is you, or is the, the real you, to Rolf? I don't think I'm that brutal. In real life. Cry all you want, but just remember what I said. But then again, he lets him go at the end in the play, so I guess maybe pretty close. Right. No one out here, sir. I'll come get you the foot cross. Let's go, move me. So what do you think about the lonely goat herd scene? I feel like I'm a fool. Is that good? What's your favorite part about the Sound of Music production in Minor? My favorite part of the Sound of Music about this production? Hmm. The kids, I think. Working with the kids. The kids have been great. Costume are those costumes that I don't have to handle. The most complicated costumes are the kids, I guess, making sure the boys have their suits on, right? <laughs> Thank you. 
So what do you play? Marta. And how is Marta different from your own personality? Um, <laughs> the difference is, is that that was back in the 70s. I think, yeah. Back in the 70s. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 How do you think the crowd's going to respond tonight? Well, if they never eat turkey, I think they'll be laughing. Uh, what is your favorite part of uh, being in Sound of Music in Maine News? Mm, I get to sing without anyone telling me to shut up. is different from your actual personality? I'm oh, shy. I'm so shy. <laughs> I can and my character is very shy. I you said my... I think it's funny because I have to play a five-year-old and I'm nine years old. And you get to dance. And I get to dance. That's one of my favorite sports. Shulman said last night that his two favorite songs are Ordinary Couple and How Can Love Survive? Yeah. Which uh, I didn't ask him, but oddly enough, they're the two songs that are not in the movie. Right. How do you think it's different, or how do you think the movie has influenced the production of the play? Very self-hero. I agree with him. I don't know why they cut them from the movie. I think they're really good songs. No little shack do you share with me. We do not flee from all the key. How can love survive? You're fond of bonds and you own a lot. I have a plane and a diesel yacht. Plenty of nothing you haven't got. How can love survive? The ride for us on the top of the bus in the face of the freezing breezes. You reach your goals in your comfy old rolls or in one of your Changed the Baroness. It really toned down Max and it changed the Baroness, didn't it? So yeah. Max and the Baroness are a lot more fun in the play, I think. Yeah. A lot more fun. Yeah. Favorite song in the play? Well, it's of course it's my song. <laughs> what else would be my favorite song? The only problem with my song is I have to share it with Max. Oh. <laughs> oh. I love Max, but I mean, I really think I should have a solo, don't you? <laughs> now, if you had a choice of what role you wanted to take, what what role would you? She to play be ridiculous, my Elsa, of course. <laughs> She play my and, and It's Elsa. Did I mention Elsa? <laughs> Elsa, Elsa, Elsa. And what's the best thing about the sound of music in Maynooth? Elsa. Elsa. <laughs> Certainly Elsa. You'll be cool. I get to do everybody's hair. Everybody that's happy. Who has the best hair? 
Who has the most fun hair or okay. the best hair? Okay, fun hair. Um, Pippa, I think, has the most fun hair. I'm going to go back to the Abbey. The Abbey? I'm going to be a nun. Oh, how nice. Oh, Who has the best makeup? Do you I think? Do. The most unique. fun to put on? I do, of um, course. <laughs> Everybody's fun, but. But me. Am Amber and Pippa get the most. And Lori. That's me. Oh! Sorry! That's me! What's your favorite song in the play? They're all good. Oh, my favorite thing is getting the audience to laugh because it's just the best feeling in the world. I've got all the non-speaking punchlines in the play, so. <laughs> What's your favorite song of the play? Um, I'm 16, going on 17. Can you sing a few uh, bars? Oh, no way! <laughs> sing a few bars. Uh, now I'm going to have to pick one of the other songs. <laughs> I don't know the words. I can hum it. I can sing it when she what plays it. What about Dora Deer? Oh, yes, of course. I know that one. <laughs> and uh, what is your favorite prop? My favorite prop would be... Jeez, I don't know. For this honor, the judges have awarded the trio of the Sangerbrunk of Hair Bacon. <laughs> what's, uh, what's your favorite song of the play? Climb Every Mountain. Can you sing a few bars to Climb Every Mountain?